Question 10. A group with five students and three teachers is to be arranged in a circle. In how many ways can this be done if no more than two students can sit together? There's multiple ways of going about this particular question. We're dealing with a circular arrangement, and the way I'm going to go about it is to fix one of the teachers in the first position, so I'm going to call that T1 for teacher 1, and this gives rise to three cases. So let's go through the three cases. In the first case, teacher T1 is at the top of the circle, surrounded by two students on either side, so student 1, student 2, student 3, student 4, and then there's teacher two here and teacher three here, such that no more than two students are seated together, and the fifth student is seated here, S5. Now, the number of arrangements in this particular configuration is five factorial for the five factorial ways of arranging the students times two factorial, which is the number of ways of arranging teacher two and teacher three, since those two can be swapped around. Let's have a look at the second case. We have T1 up the top. We have student one here, student three and four here. We have teacher two here, teacher three here, and then we have two students here, student two and student five. And again, there's five factorial times two factorial ways of arranging the teachers and students in this configuration. And the final case, is T1 here, we have two students here, S1, S2, we have the third student here, S3, we have teacher two here, teacher three here, and then two students here, S4 and S5. And again, there's five factorial times two factorial ways of arranging these students and teachers in this configuration. So the total number of arrangements is given by 5 factorial times 2 factorial times the three cases, and 2 factorial times 3 simplifies to 3 factorial, so 5 factorial times 2 factorial times 3 simplifies to 5 factorial times 3 factorial. Therefore, the correct answer is option B.